Hey doll lovers, welcome to my channel, Doll Days 252. Um, got a bunch of Barbies, um, wanted to share them with you. Um, I have a store locally uh, about 30 minutes away called the Yard Sales Store. They're in Chesapeake, Virginia. Um, they are moving to a new location, so they have a 60% off store-wide sale. And I was in there probably six months ago or so, and they had gotten in a big selection of uh, late, late 90s, uh, early 2000 Barbies. And I did get a few of them, but some of their prices were just too high for what they had. They had a lot of holiday Barbies, a lot of really overproduced 90s Barbies that um, I just thought the price was were a little high and they weren't Barbies like I had to have. So anyways, when I heard they were having 60% off, um, I thought I'd go look and see what was left and they had a lot left. So I ended up scooping up quite a few, maybe six or seven, um, but I'm going to show them to you. I think I'm going to end up unboxing, unboxing them all, um, but for today I will probably just unbox one. Um, but let me show you what I got. So I've already got a reproduction Malibu Barbie, but I don't want to leave behind a Malibu Barbie. And for the price I got her, I couldn't resist. So I've got another one. She is a reproduction. Um, she comes with a, I guess like a souvenir box. Um, it says on the back, let me read it to you. Malibu Barbie would twist and turn weight. She's back for another day in the sun. Do you remember your very first Malibu Barbie doll with groovy sunglasses and a happen in bathing suit? She was the quintessential California girl. Her twist and turn waist and bendable legs kept her moving and grooving. Now you can discover the fun all over again. Our new collector edition, Malibu Barbie, brings back all the fun in the sun. A wonderful reproduction of the original 1971 doll. She is authentically recreated with fabulous long blonde hair and that famous deep rich tan. She's dressed in a reproduction of the aqua blue bathing suit in which she was originally introduced, complete with her yellow towel. A sunscreen bottle updates her for the 21st century. Live the beach lifestyle. Amen. Wish I could. Can't do it right now. The beach is about 45 minutes away. But with a cool California attitude. Uh, Malibu Barbie takes you back. And that's what the back of the box looks like. It's got Malibu on the beach. Um, and this reproduction, I want to say, yeah, 2001. So like I said, I've already got her. She's in my curio cabinet. Um, and I do have the, um, was it the 50th anniversary? Yeah, the 50th anniversary edition where they did my favorite Barbie. Um, I've got her up there that came with the um, yellow toll like top and bottoms. Um, I'll show you that another day. But, okay, so I got her. I got a class one from the Classique collection. She is Starlight Dance Barbie, a heavenly dream in white for starlit nights. She is fifth in a series of dolls. Um, I have another one from this collection that I've had since she was she came out. Um, I got her as a Christmas present. She is in my curio cabinet. But this is what this doll looks like. I'm sorry if you can't see her very well because of that light. Um, she does have rooted eyelashes, which sold me on her. Um, it says, Barbie is an ethereal beauty, dressed in the palest creamy satin and chiffon, sprinkled with stardust. Sheer panels make her skirt seem to float. 
cloud-like in the wind while brilliant rhinestones reflecting tiny rainbows of light add to the sense of movement. Her long hair, swept high under a shimmering headband, falls gently in one soft curl to her shoulder. With her large, gentle eyes and sweet smile, Barbie looks like an angel dancing in the stars. And this is a little bit about the designer. Um, this is a quote from the designer. Little did I realize when my parents helped me make my dream fur jacket that someday I'd be designing for the most elegant doll in the world. Um, there it was in vogue, the most beautiful coat Cynthia had ever seen. Just a little girl, she knew she couldn't have the white fur, but her father and mother found a way to make her dream come true. Taking her to a fabric store, they bought some white faux fur. Her father then cut patterns from paper bags. Her mother helped her sew the fabric on her sewing machine. Cynthia loved her little white jacket and wore it in the coldest winters. Years later, after graduating from the University of Cincinnati and designing for movie stars and the most famous doll in the world, Cynthia fondly remembers that first sewing project and her parents who started her career. Um, so yeah, her name is Cynthia Young and she designed the Starlight Dance Barbie doll. Okay, so we've got her. Okay, we'll do her next. This is the Grand Ole Opry Rising Star Barbie. And I'd seen her before. I actually, um, let me see, how many is in a series here? This one is the second in a series. Um, I think I have the first in a series um, already. Um, but yeah, I'd seen her before. I didn't want her for the price they wanted for her, but 60% off, that price was great. It's cute because she comes with like, you know, when you get a little gold record and the, I guess the music company frames it for you and put your picture by it. Um, this actually comes out and it's so cute. It says, presented to Rising Star Barbie to commemorate the state of our love by the Grand Old Opry. Our love is the song. But I guess she sings. And she also has rooted eyelashes. That was one of the things I liked about her. Um, she has a little microphone. She's got the Bob Mackie face, red hair. Um, she does come with a stand because she's a collector doll. And she also comes with a little CD. If anyone's got a CD player anymore. Um, I don't. Although, yeah, I do. I've got a DVD player. You could put it in that. Uh, so yeah, this song is called Our Love, and it says, I'd just like to thank my producers, Buddy Cannon and Nora Wilson. I would also like to thank Troy Tomlinson from Opryland Music Group. This recording wouldn't have been possible without you. All my love, Rising Star Barbie. You want to hear the lyrics to the song, or is that too much for you? Okay, I'll show you, because they're in the box. Our love. I never thought I'd be feeling this way. I'm walking around in a cloud. Can't get this silly looking grin off my face, but I wouldn't replace what I'm feeling right now. The way you love me is a heavenly dream. It's almost too good to be true. I can't explain it, but you know what I mean. There's something special about me and you. And our love brings the sun out on a rainy day. Our love thunders in my heart. Our love is never going to go away. Nothing in the world could keep us apart. There's nothing stronger than our love. We got up something so incredibly rare. We're lucky as lucky can be. There's people looking for it everywhere. But I got you and you got me. And our love brings the sun out on a rainy day. Our love thunders in my heart. Our love is never going to go away. Nothing in the world could keep us apart. There's nothing stronger than our love. 
I don't believe I'll ever figure it out. Why in the world should I try? I know we're perfect and there isn't a doubt. We're going to make it, baby, you and I. Because, and then you repeat the chorus again, um, and then it don't get better than our love. So that is Rising Star Barbie. This one is Rose Barbie. She also has the Bob Mackie face. Uh, I do love the Steffi, Bowl, uh, Steffi Molds and Bob Mackie's the best. Um, I thought her dress was pretty. It's very detailed. She's got pretty jewelry, some pearls, a pearl headband. Um, it says on the back of this... This is the um, A Garden of Flowers collection, and she is Rose Barbie. So, roses have been named for queens and presidents. Now there's a rose for Barbie. To celebrate her 40th anniversary, a beautiful pink miniature rose has been commissioned in her honor from Jackson and Perkins, the world's largest annual plant producer of roses. It is officially named the Barbie Rose. And I guess this is what the Barbie Rose looks like. This Barbie was made in 1998. Um, then it says, Welcome to a Garden of Flowers, an exciting collection featuring Barbie and different outfits inspired by the beauty and irresistible charm of flowers. The first Barbie doll in this series celebrates the rose, the most popular flower in the world and often called the Queen of Flowers. No flower is closer to the human heart than the beautiful rose. Loved and cherished throughout time, the rose has been a favorite of poets, kings, goddesses, and countries. With its wonderful variety of colors, sizes, and fragrance, it's no wonder that the rose is the most popular flower in the world. And so, it is appropriate that a rose is the flower named for Barbie. Dressed to celebrate the occasion, your Rose Barbie doll wears an exquisite pink gown accented with roses. Large, two-tone ribbon clusters resembling roses decorate her sleeves, while a pretty lace panel highlights the satin bodice. Her rose front skirt has a charming white lace overskirt and a pale green sash tied at her waist. She carries a single pink rosebud with ribbon streamers. Her long strawberry blonde hair has a band of rosy pink and pale green ribbons. Rose Barbie is truly as fresh and beautiful as the special rose named for her. And here's the one single rose in her hand. So there you go, Rose Barbie. Let me make sure this is turned up 